Today we're doing a microneedling treatment on our patient here. This is her first treatment. As you can see, we've already done the forehead area. She has gotten 10 point bleeding, which is excellent. How are you feeling? Good. Good. Oh, so during a microneedling treatment, uh, what we're putting on now is phase. So phase is actually a glide. There's hyaluronic acid in it. It just helps the 36 pin needle um, glide over the skin. Also by keeping moisture in as well. So from the forehead, you move down to the temple area, which we did on the left. I'm gonna have you open your eyes. I'm gonna be really light here. Okay. Under the eyes. Just a light treatment for under the eyes. How does that feel for you? Fine. Okay. Really nice and numb. Good. Okay, look up. Okay. So what are your main concerns for your skin? What was your reasoning for coming in and doing this microneedling treatment? Um, wanting more collagen and elastin production as I'm aging. Um, minimizing fine lines and wrinkles. Improving the overall like pigmentation of my okay. skin. So you were just concerned too about hyperpigmentation mm -hmm. just from the sun over time. Mm -hmm. So microneedling is excellent for all of these things. Typically, you would have three treatments. Um, with your first treatment, you will see a great improvement in your skin tone, so that's great. The tip of the nose is usually kind of tickly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's it is. a little bit sneezy. <laughs> Are you doing okay? Yep. Typically, this procedure takes about 15 to 20 minutes, and as you can see, it's not uncomfortable or unbearable in any way. The patient is completely numb for an hour prior to the procedure. It really helps with your pores, too, on your nose. Okay. Typically people, that's where they struggle the most, is on their nose, with blackheads, deeper pores, visible pores, so microneedling is really good at helping diminish the size of the pores in this area, as well as other areas on the face, but really the nose, it helps a lot. As you can see, Leslie is changing the settings on the microneedling pin. This is because she's going down to a different area, the area of the cheek, which is a little bit thicker than the area of skin on the forehead. So that way she gets a deeper treatment. You feeling okay? Yep. Some of our patients tell us it's relaxing in a way because it's kind of a white noise, a light hum. Yeah, they get a little sleepy. <laughs> mm Looks like on the chin area, you do have a little bit of scarring, which microneedling is also excellent for scarring and stretch marks, so in other areas of the body. So you will see an improvement there as well. Great. We move down into the chin area. 
And then last but not least, the other cheek. We can't wait to see your results. Please see our Instagram name in the caption of this video and add us to see before and after results.